Welcome to Computron Support. On this incredibly quick and easy video tutorial, we're going to set an additional clock on Windows 10. When we, well, when we left click on the clock down the bottom corner of your, uh, your desktop, obviously it shows today's calendar, date, time, that type of thing. Now, I was asked by a customer who has family in Australia, I was asked, is there a way to display an additional world clock on, uh, on their screen? Uh, of course, you can go to the Windows Store um, and you can search for uh, world clock or world time or something like that and there will be a whole load of different apps that you can install some of which are gadgets and will display the the, the clocks on your screen um, but collectively these things use process on the computer so you don't really want these things running all the time um, and of course it might be a handy thing to know the time in a different uh, part of the world perhaps you have you have friends or family um, in the other side of the world and you want to know if it's a good time to Skype or FaceTime them. Uh, so here's how to add an, a clock, uh, an additional clock to, to Windows. Okay, let's do this. Uh, when we left click on the clock down on the bottom corner of the screen, as we've, uh, we've seen already, it shows us the, uh, the local time. If we right click on the clock, one of the options here is adjust date and time. Let's left click on that. Let's take that. And depending on the resolution of your screen, we're looking for, it might be on the right hand side, it might be down below. Uh, we're looking for the related settings that says add clocks for, a, well, for different time zones. When we click on that, let me just zoom in on that uh, dialog box for you. Let's add a clock. First of all, tick the box that says show this clock. Uh, from there, let's uh, let's pick a clock and I'm just gonna pick something random, one that I can pronounce. Uh, there's Baghdad, okay, we know where that is. Give it a name as well. Um, for that, I'll just put in Iraq. There we are, so Iraq. Um, and we hit apply, done, that's it. That's all you have to do. What happens now when you roll your mouse over the clock on the bottom corner, um, it's actually displaying our local time and also the time in the chosen additional clock state. Uh, when we left click on the clock, so we're working on the, uh, the computer, left click on the clock, um, what it's showing us here, it's showing just now that it's uh, 20 past 11 in the evening, our time. Uh, in Iraq, it's, uh, it's now 20 past 1 a.m. in the morning, uh, but it's already tomorrow there. So you can kind of see how this works. Uh, so you can check by one click of your mouse. You can always check what time. Now, of course, uh, you can add um, additional clocks to that. You may have noticed when we had that dialog box up, uh, it was saying clock one and clock two. You can have up to three clocks on here. Uh, but a handy little tip, if you do have friends or family um, overseas, quite far away, and one click of the mouse or one click on the cursor uh, will show you exactly what time it is in their part of the world. Thanks for watching. 